Hello everyone. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys some recent TTM returns. So let's get started. So the first one is postmarked from Baltimore, Maryland. It took nine days and the person signed four of four for me. So let's see who this person is. It is Mr. Bobby Ingram. Now Mr. Bobby Ingram is considered the greatest uh, receiver to ever come out of Penn State. He was a three-time AP All-American. He was the 1994 Citrus Bowl MVP. And he was also the 1994 Blitnikoff Award. He was the first ever winner of the Blitnikoff Award. While at Penn State, he was he's the all-time leader in yards receiving with 3,026 in 31 TDs. Now, he doesn't hold uh, the receptions uh, career mark. Uh, that is held by Deshaun Hamilton, who's currently uh, with the Denver Broncos. Uh, that mark is... 214. Now, Bobby did have 167 receptions during his playing days at Penn State. He also racked up 786 career punt yards, uh, punt return yards, I should say, which ranks him second in school history. Now, after his college career, he was drafted in the second round by the Dell Bears, and he holds the Bears franchise rec record for the most receptions in a game of 13. After spending five years with the Bears, he moved on to played eight years with the Seattle Seahawks. Now, while in Seattle, in 2007, he set the franchise mark with 94 receptions. He only had 1,000-yard receiving year, and that was in 2007, and that was for, for 1,147 yards. For his career, he had 650 receptions. 7,751 yards and 35 TDs. He is now the Ravens tight end coach. And this is Mr. Bobby Ingram. There's one. There's two. There's three. And there's the fourth one. Let's see if we can set this right here in the middle. There we go. All right, the next one is postmarked from Charlotte, North Carolina. It took 11 days, and the person signed 4-4 for me, so let's see who this person is. And this person would be Mr. Mark Carrier, the wide receiver, not the DB. So, Mr. Mark Carrier, he was the third-round pick out of Nickel State. He was an AP All-American in 1986 at Nickel State. He was also a first-team Kodak All-American in 1986 while in college. He is the all-time leading receiver at Nickel State with 142 receptions for 2,709 yards. He also holds the record with the yards per catch with 20.4 yards per catch. And he also had holds school record uh, with the most 100-yard games with 11. Now, after college, he played 12 seasons in the NFL for the Buccaneers, the Browns, and the Panthers. His best year, which was a Pro Bowl year, he caught 86 passes for 1,422 yards and 9 TDs. He is the person who scored the first TD in franchise history on September 1st, 1995 for the Carolina Panthers. So he's the one that scored the first points in franchise history while on the Panthers. Now, during his career, he played in 177 games. He had 569 catches for 8,723. 8,763 yards with a 15.4 average per catch and 48 TDs. He also had 21 punt returns for 229 yards for a 10.9 average and one TD. And this is Mr. Mark Carrier, the wide receiver. And there's one. There's 
two. I like that one there. That's a cool action shot. Let's see if we get to stand up, stand up, Mark. There's three. And the fourth one is when he was with the Browns. So I would like to thank Mr. Mark Carrier and Mr. Bobby Ingram for signing these cards and sending them back to me. I also would like to thank you guys for watching. Just remember, keep collecting, keep searching for those hidden gems, and keep having fun. Later.